Hi, my name is Sean Walsh. I'm in the 11th grade, and welcome to Everyday Titan. My time has come to an end. Titans, today is Monday, February 26th, and I'm Autumn Basara. It's a bittersweet feeling me stepping down as host, but I had a great, a great experience. Join us in honoring the victims of Stoneman Douglas High School shooting tomorrow, the 27th, where the colors of Douglas High School maroon, black, maroon, black, and gold to stand in solidarity with the victims and raise awareness of the fight against gun violence. Students will be giving out orange ribbons at the doors and, 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 and at all lunches as Orange represents the movement against gun violence. There will also be an information table tomorrow, as well as an opportunity to write letters of support to the students at Stoneman Douglas. Let's show, them we ha let's show them that we support their efforts. It's time to shift focus to another famous black woman for this week's trivia history. Barbara Jordan was a politician, civil rights leader, and lawyer who became the first black woman to serve in the Texas Senate and the first black woman to deliver the keynote of de of the, at the Democratic National Convention. Jordan's 1974 remark, opening remarks at the start of President Nixon's impeachment hearing are considered among the best of the 20th century. It is wrong, I suggest it is a misreading of the Constitution for any member here to assert that for a member to vote for an article of impeachment means that the members must be convinced that the president should be removed from office. The Constitution doesn't say that. The powers relating to the impeachment are an essential check in the hands of the legislator against, the, against and upon the encroachments of the executive. Thanks for Kevin Granados for putting that, for putting that together for us. Have you had trouble picking classes for next year? Here's another great option, AP, AP Literature and Composition, taught by Mr. Matthew Zahn. Check it out. Hi, I'm Matt Zahn, and I teach AP Literature here at TC. Um, one of my favorite things about teaching the course is that it really pushes kids, um, pushes kids to be better writers, better thinkers. We read some of the greatest authors in literature, um, and have fun talking about them and thinking about them, and then most of all, ad addressing the complex truth um, that authors present. Really getting into what makes what makes something art. You know that that it that it tells something true, um, and then prepares kids for for writing at the college level too. Uh, we write and write and write. Um, and the thing about taking AP AP English is, if you do, you will definitely be ready to write papers in college. Thanks to Advanced TV Media 3 student, SA Test Day for that package. It's challenging class, but definitely worth it. Attention students who took the ASVAB. Scores back review session is today at 845 in the College and Career Center, so you should probably head out there right, right now. There's a session, the session provides valuable information to, un, to help you understand what your score means and how they can relate to your educational and career goals. Get a pass and head to the College and Career Center now, or you can just wait till after the show. The, classes, the Class of 2018 Career Fair and Senior Information Night will be held on Tuesday, March 6th, beginning at 3.15 p.m. To, to, there will be reps from over 20 different career paths there. At, at 5.30 in the auditorium, you can learn about all the special senior events. Families are encouraged to attend the entire event. The Latin Club is continuing its canned food drive for the Capital Area Food Bank. You can drop off your donations in the main office, trailer F904, or any academic or any academy office. Tryouts for the boys' soccer team continue on the TCW main field. Eighth to ninth, twelfth graders are eligible for tryouts. You have a you have you must have a completed physical and emergency contact form on file with the athletic department in order to be eligible for tryouts. Tryouts will last from 3:30 p.m. to 6 p.m. There will be an activity bus to take you home after tryouts. 
The Academy of Finance student interviews are, will take place all day on Tuesday, February 27th in room 120. Applications are still available under the announcement tab in Canvas. Come dressed for success and meet the AOF teachers. Amazing opportunities are ahead of your way in just a few more days. We can make it happen for you. Have you been keeping up with our Black History Month trivia questions? You can submit your responses to this email. Congratulations to Seamus Brown for being the first to submit the correct answer. Please came, claim your sweet prize in room A228. Here's the next question. Yesterday's trivia question was, Answer to yesterday's question is Whitney Houston. Houston is the most awarded female artist of all time with 22 American Music Awards and seven Grammy Awards, along with many others. Even though she is gone, her influence on music is still very prevalent today. Today's trivia question is... Congrats to the winner. Come by room A227 for your prize, and I'll see you tomorrow for the next trivia question. Thanks to Michelle Marfil and Gab Hendy for that package. What? Oh, okay. I've just been informed that we have a surprise package for me. Let's roll the clip, I guess. The crew here at Everyday Titan, the crew here at Everyday Titans If you wear cowboy clothes, are you ranch dressing? <laughs> How could you do this to me? I thought you loved me! It's not what you think. You think you can pack off a real cucumber as pure deliciousness? I'm Autumn Basara. And I'm Autumn Basara. And I'm Autumn Basara. Can we be freezing that? <laughs> yes. Oh. I also want to wish our wonderful camera person, Charlotte Despard, a happy birthday. And thank you for that great package. I'm going to miss the spotlight. Well, that's all we have for you today for today's show. Well, that's the last time I'll be saying that. OK, I'm getting a little too caught up. You'll finally be meeting your new host tomorrow. Peace, Titans, forever.